Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Deltarune with Chaos Counseling. Let's go say goodbye. It's a goodbye to everybody. Chris, Susie, you came back? Um, well, Chris just wanted to say bye, you know? Oh, actually, everyone here wanted to say goodbye, too. Please let me know when you leave, all right? Yeah, yeah, we'll try not to skip you. Oh, my gosh. So we could either go to the beginning or let's just go down the line, actually. Well, let's just go down the line. It's fine. Way to go, kids. Now we can go back to making the puzzles we love. Yay! And thanks to your donation, I could buy a new hat and some shaving cream. <laughs> Good. Got nothing left to teach you now. Life's got no tutorial, so try your best. No, I don't like that. <laughs> best. You're the best. No. Okay. Honestly, you yeah, yeah. Uh... You're absolutely amazing! <laughs> the grim work. <laughs> I, I want to point this out. It's B O O B B. <laughs> oh my gosh! B O B? Because it starts with a B, B they focus on O. o. Focus oh, on O. Oh, you. And B. B. <laughs> and a boob. Boob. When I saw that, I was like, gosh. Dick. You mean you're more good than you mean you're good you? Yay! Thank you. I can go back to being a coat hanger now. <laughs> By the way, I asked, uh, see, Sham, Sham, to come here, but I forgot how the pronunciation works. It's not seem, it's Sham, she, Sham, it's Sham. Okay, come here, bud. There wasn't any interest. No. Oh. Okay. Don Horsey, you've you've been done us a big help. <laughs> now all all of us pieces can live in pieces. <laughs> Boy, my nostrils can't take you enough. <laughs> and uh, you out to that rotten tyrant. I'll happily accept a bounty of credit for my contributions, unless the king reappears, in which case I did nothing. <laughs> oh jeez. Uh, who wants to? I'll try. Okay. Wonderful work, my, my amigos! <laughs> Thou hast toppled the tyrant, freedest our creedest. Truly, as history shall not forget the tale of Roscard and the Three Heroes. What about the part where you try to kill us? Uh, an uh, interesting historical theory, is it not? Nonetheless, the evidence precludeth such a thing. What evidence? I shall give it thou a plate of worms for thou silence! Deal. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you could do it. Thou is your enemy. I was cheering for you. You know, I don't... Some much I dislike my job. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I do have to give this game credit as a sequel to Undertale that was all about... Saving everybody, you know, except for Azriel. Honey, I don't think they can hear you looking down at your mini figs at a table on the other side of the room. I do have to give this game credit as a sequel to Undertale. That was all about saving everyone and befriending everyone. The fact that the king still wanted to fight, I actually admit, is kind of a good breaking of form for this series. I really like what Toby did with this game, honestly. Mm -hmm. The future looks sweet! Like a pile of bees puke! It's just honey, I think. A kingdom with so much hope! Hope you didn't screw it up! That means thank you. Come to our next V-Day, too! We'll have one soon! If that's possible. Shut up, third head! <laughs> Happy looked at you proudly. Kiss! <laughs> Limit one. Aww! <laughs> What's going on? I slept through everything. I'm confused. Oh, jeez. The animal crackers. What ho? What about us? Aren't we going to be restored as kings? Ah, uh, my treasure is unharmed. Carry on, then. <laughs> <laughs> if you, it's, it's been a while, but if you remember in the sale, he was like, What happened to my treasure? Get to me out so I know what's up with my treasure. Oh. Now that we're like, oh, your treasure's fine. Oh, okay, okay I'll just stay here then. Us animals decide it's okay if the king stays. This is in the cages as well. But I've put animal ears in the ears. <laughs> <laughs> Mom, 
some amoeba! What a celebration! Everyone is here! This must be the birthday party I made that cake for! Clover's birth! Such a sweet occasion, I might cry! Uh, actually, this whole thing is, like, our fault. Oh! Mon amiga! Then you're Clover's mother! Oh my gosh! Now I understand why you ate the cake to protect her! Huh? Wait, no, I... Wait, if I go along with this, can I get more cake? Clover's mother! Please sample my cakes anytime! Do I have to be Clover's mom to do that? Yes! That's my arbitrary rule! <laughs> that I am now Clover's mother. <laughs> I'll be honest, at first we weren't sure who make our new king. I mean, Lancer has always been a bit of a pain. But after seeing how nice he treats you guys, I think he'll be fine. Hi, Lancer. Susie! Blue person you <laughs> neglected to learn all along! Oh I thought you were going home ways. We were, but Chris wanted to say bye, you know? Oh, really? Oh, that's funny! I thought you wanted to say bye because we're friends! Uh, I mean, I did not want to! Um, so, you're the king now, huh? Yes, and I'm changing some big rules. First, lightners are now legal. Second, prison is now only for dogs. <laughs> Sounds like a pretty good change. <laughs> <laughs> hey, your dad was uh, protecting the fountain, right? Is it going to be okay if we mess with it? I have no idea. <laughs> but it's you guys, so I trust you. If something bad happens, we'll fix it out. Yeah, and we'll guess we'll just see, I guess. Uh, well, see you later. Come back soon! There's always room in town for a couple of clowns. You should tell your prince to say goodbye as well. Is he leaving? No, he's just a sweet little peach. <laughs> <laughs> and the very last thing, because he rescued it, it grew to respect you. Well, actually, maybe it shrunk to respect you. <laughs> Oh, bless Aww. this castle. Bless these people. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And now it's time. Here we go. Uh. Time to go fuck everything up. I have <laughs> such a bad feeling. Uh, I'll talk to Rollside real quick. Oh, yes. Chris, Susie, are you leaving? Hell if I know. I'm just following Chris. Guess we'll just walk to the right if we are. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking uh. gosh darn it. Susie, Chris, are you going to leave? You can come with. Um, I. Aww. I just wanted to say I. I. I really enjoyed meeting you two, and. Hey, can you stop mumbling into your, into your hat for a sec? Can barely hear you, dude. Oh, oh I'm sorry. Whoa. Um, Chris, Susie, I. He's cute. Just want to point out he looks like Toriel. He looks like. Azriel. Well, yeah, I totally knew that from the start, but yeah. it's it's like I it's been a while since I'd seen him, but I have Toriel's head in my with glasses in my head. I hope I can see you again soon. Next time I'll make you lots of yummy cake, alright? Um yeah, sure, dude. <laughs> Chris help he's hot. <laughs> Let's go, Chris! So, something I want to point out, uh, <laughs> when Jesse shouted, Azriel! I was like, oh! <laughs> like, because if you mix up Ralsei's yep. name, you get it's Azriel. And also, if you invert the colors of Ralsei, it's white. Ye. With ye. 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 As soon as the ghost chi goat child appeared, I'm like, oh, hey, it's Azriel. Yeah. <laughs> or at least a stand-in, because we're a sad child. Whoa. Ooh. This is Susie. Oh, is this the fountain? Don't know how, but it feels like we stumbled into something really important, didn't we? Yeah, a big sequel. Oh, shit. Well, there's no time to think about anything now. Right now, it's time to go home. Right, Chris? 
As you stood in front of the fountain, we're gonna fuck it up. You felt something strange. It was as if your very soul was glowing. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Guitar. Oh, the title disappeared on the top of the window. Yeah, it was called The Dark. Yeah, but now it's nothing. Uh, What happened? I can't see anything. (laughs) Hey, watch it! (laughs) The fuck? Oh my gosh, it's the... It's everything. Like, that's everything. There's Mm -hmm. the chest pieces, and that's probably the forest over there on the carpet, and that's the castle in the cupboard. It's fucking the Alice cars. in Wonderland, man. Uh huh. Mm-hmm. The unused classroom? Mm-hmm. How do we get in here? You're stepping on Lego, mm-hmm. Susie. Careful! <laughs> hey, Chris. Mm-hmm. What? Mm-hmm. What just happened? Mm-hmm. Like, that wasn't a dream or anything, was it? Oh, is that the cat back there? The plush? Yep. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Anyway, as I was saying, mm-hmm. let's just tell Alfie's we couldn't find any chalk. So, uh, it's a worn down stuffed animal. What is happening? The door is locked. It's a checkerboard. There are pawns strewn on it. Uh, it's a light switch. Playing cards spill out of a deck in the closet. It's a yellow, poorly drawn picture of a green turtle. (laughs) It's signed, Alvin. Shit, why do I know that name? Uh... It's okay, it'll make sense in a bit. Oh, okay. Mm. It's okay if you, like, don't know it, because I would be surprised if you did. Man, the sun's already setting. Everyone else must have gone home by now. Guess Alfie's will know better than to ask us next time, huh? We went through that door, though. Yep. What? Well, guess we should go. See you later, I guess. Oh, your eyes are gone. Come back. Mm. At least we could see it in her icon. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. Chris? Let's go back there tomorrow, all right? Aww. She would do it. No, come back, Susie! The door is locked. Aww. Mm. The door is locked. No. Alfie's gonna be no, not Alfie's. Uh, Toriel's gonna be pissed. Chris, whatever have you been doing? I sat in the car waiting for you after school for half an hour. I called and called, but you never picked up. You had your poor mother worried sick. Chris, I am afraid I am going to have to punish you. Huh? A friend? You were spending time with a friend? Chris, I will make an exception this time. This one time. You can continue your adventures a little longer. But when you return home, you are going to have to go to bed early. See you soon, honey. Ah, you made friends! Uh, let's see. You ran the water fountain. It's lukewarm. You ran the water fountain. It's tepid. tepid. You ran the water fountain. It's refreshingly, refreshingly cool. cool. And then it's cool. Yeah. For some reason, that's how it always works. Do you like breathing, <laughs> moving fast with or without legs? But usually with legs. Join the cross country team with Jockington and Noel. <laughs> Jockington. Yeah, he's a snake. Oh, there's Toriel's classroom. Yeah. Miss Toriel is written in cursive on the dry erase board. Seems like it hasn't been erased in a very long time. No need to. Some kind of primitive sculpture. <laughs> Who knows what it represents? They'll never know the minds of these kindergartners. <laughs> nope. Some kind of teacher food. Teacher food! <laughs> Kids' books. Some of them used to be yours. It's a primitive drawing of your mom. Bless. It's a poster of several basic shapes. Circle, oval, oval, square, and hyperdodecahedron. <laughs> hyperdodecahedron. <laughs> the throne of the gods. <laughs> what? It's chair stacked yeah, on top of it. 
<laughs> Did you ever do that thing where like when I chairs yell were... that all the time because that can damage the chair? Or I yeah, mean, for sure, same. we yelled at that too. But every child, every child deep does down, does wanted to get on top of theirs. Every time it happened, like at the end, the end of the year was yesterday, and I just saw like every stack of chairs had a child on top of it, and I'm like, I should yell at you, but we fuck it. <laughs> We've all been there, you know. Mm-hmm. Every child. So you ever wanted to explore this town that we saw? Finally! Yes. 